In this channel, we have a tradition where I suit up for the season finale, but still no pants. You know why? Good, this is a hobby, not a job. Let's begin. Yo, Zeri tried to poach her. Baron passes. Now, who's opening? Denken, Grandpa passes. Zeri. The pinnacle elf maze, I don't know, but Zeta is like pretty important, right, in this realm? I know all about you. Yo, the Denkin respect? Maybe Zeta should be honored. Most influential. Self-made man. Bro is an actual hero, dude. Honestly, I wish I could have met you when you were still young. That's crazy. You know how much Zeta like kind of like quote-unquote disrespects humans, right? She's very picky, right? She's very picky in who she even gets in. What was it? Flame? And then there's that Lernster guy or something, right? Last episode. The guy that, like, apparently created the Goldens as well. And beyond that, Denken. She's like, damn, I wish I met you in your prime, Denken. That's crazy, man. The amount of respect Denken's getting. What was that? Peak? That, that, that was prime Denken? Look, look, look. <laughs> it's just Denken without a beard. And, you know, better skincare. Well, they, they really like, you know, say it's any fan service, it's just her toes. It's just, it's just toes every time. <laughs> this fight. This fight. Nah. <laughs> you pass! You pass! Because Denken thought about fighting her. He passes. Well, even beyond that. That's like cherry on top, right? Yubel is delusional in the head. I feel like if this entire test is based on how much you believe in yourself and how much you don't get intimidated by Zede, then wouldn't it make sense that Yubel would pass? What? Oh, hey, hey! <laughs> Don't even need to talk. Look at your eyes. Your eyes is constantly just flexing na eyed win. She's the walking embodiment of na eyed win. She just has the most smug look that just looks down on you. It's like, nah, I would win. Easy. Uh, what about the MILF? The MILF. The girl that's name starts with M. You build potential boyfriend, but is that a joke? Because this is a copy, right? So. Doesn't that mean that he would fail? Megane would fail because he sent in a body, body a double. Because he's being cautious. Because he's not confident that he could beat her in a fight, right? Wouldn't that kind of make sense that he's being, because he's being like cautious, kind of being like a coward, having a body double sent, therefore he would fail? He's not, where is he? That's it? We finally see his real body? Bro was fucking working from home. Bro just attended the school and graduated over Zoom. Bro is fucking Mechamaru from Jujutsu Kaisen. He's not in even the same fucking scene. He was fucking hometown the entire time? Online exam. Pass? How far is he? He's actually having tea. That's hilarious. Okay, I'm wrong. He passes. Okay, the fact that he was being so cautious is like impressive. Zeta's like, all right, you fucking take it. Bro's like, I'm sipping tea right now. Ah. Veerbell. I feel like because we've gotten three dubs in a row, Veerbell might take an L here. I don't like, does Veerbell, is he that confident? Maybe? We did kill children. In the north, like, you, like, kill children, right? In war, right? He was probably a child back then, too, or something. You saw the fucked up flashback, so... Maybe Zede will be like, damn, you kill children? That's cold as fuck. You pass. Oh, uh, maybe he fails then. Oh, wait, 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 wait! Never mind, hold up! Because he acknowledges Zede's strength, and because he's pragmatic and objective about it, he will pass? Okay, yeah, yeah, they're, they're, they're on the same page. Magic is a tool for killing. I think they, like, Frieden was like, I like flowers. Mm, pretty flowers. <laughs> but Weirdbell's like, I like killing children with my magic. You pass. All right, all right. Zeta likes that. Okay, pass. Milf, please. Method, please. Pass, please. I want to give you a hug. <laughs> 
Her mommy milf energy. I thought you were small and cute, implying that Method basically thinks that she could beat Zeta in a fight, quote unquote, because her motherly instincts are kicking in. I think you're small and cute rather than I'm scared of you. Therefore, she's gonna pass. You pass. <laughs> Let's go! All dubs! And I just realized, you're right. Where is Zane at this moment, huh? Method is the woman that Zane has been searching for this entire time. And the moment that Zane departs from a regular party with Frieden, the mill fucking gets introduced. Poor Zane, man. Wow, acknowledging, acknowledging. Okay, they failed. Is this an official... So like... Yuval... Megane, they're, it's, it's, it's official? They're couples drifting into the sunset. In my head canon, this is a ship, dude. Congrats. Wow, I believe in you. Exchange numbers, can we be friends? I want Tenkin to stick around, no! What a noble reason to become a first class mage, man. What's she picking, donuts? Donuts? Cookies or pretzel? Both. I go with cookie though. What's up? We meet again. Oh shit. Denkin really does spoil his kids, huh? Yo, Grandpa Denkin spoiling the kids. Actually, perhaps the best character of this show, maybe. Have some. Stark has no idea who this is, right? Sip some tea, some eat. He's a legend, bro. Denkin the fucking legend. Self-made man. Oh, because he called him G-Sun. Why is Fern mad right now? Why is Fern looking at Stark like that? He just wants to spoil your kids. Probably not, right? And that's why he's like, you know, treating these kids because it's like kind of, you know, it's like honorary grandchildren or something, right? That's what I'd like to think. No, thank you. No, thank you. So sad. Past is so sad. What the fuck? Man, you're going to give me a sad backstory. Oh. Damn. Well, who are these people? Five beneath Zede. I do we know them? The back of their heads? They seem pretty fucking important though, huh? Thank is such a good character, man. He could order entire nations. Oh, some wise lessons now? What's it gonna be? Okay. Oh, really? Inspired by Frieden, huh? Yeah, you should tell her that. What the fuck? Denkin pretty much like grew up listening to the heroic tales of Frieden and the heroic party, huh? It's crazy. Like when I first saw Denkin, my initial response was like cocky old man who seems really just cocky, just talking shit. Because that's what he was kind of doing in the first couple episodes. And then all of that changed once we started to get actual more, like, dialogues from him, right? I think my respect for him grew so much. Probably during the fist fight moment. I think that's when everyone fell in love, right? When he took off the fucking jacket, and he's like, you're a man, right? And he went for the fucking uppercut. Ever since then, it's just been a fucking home run, man. What does Frieden got? So much grimoire. So many grimoire. Oh, old lady. Uh, you gonna help her out? No! Frieden's older than the granny, so you should respect the, 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 the lady that just, just tripped. She should be helping Frieden carry her books. Because if this is about helping your seniors, Frieden's on top. Oi, Baba. Uh, uh, oh! What a gentleman! Wurbel! I'm a, I'm a more senior! <laughs> yeah. More heroic? More noble? Weirdbill's character surprised me too. 
I bet he would, maybe. <laughs> well, he's like ruthless, but there's actually. <laughs> Yeah, actually, is this a problem that Ubel has not become a first class mage? That, now that I think about it, be, beyond the Ubel armpit fan service, beyond all that shit, isn't this kind of troublesome that we just granted this mania first phase privileges? Won't she like abuse it? Isn't this like incredibly dangerous? <laughs> Maybe Weirbel's correct. Maybe we should have killed her. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> oh. Any spell I desire. It's at the end of the day just to protect this town. Weirbel. Good guy. Good guy, Weirbel. He grew up like inspired by him too, right? Thousand Mirror Tower. Thousand Mirror Tower, the Bows the Immortal, Seven Sages of the... How many heroic quests did he go on? Hell Emperor Dragon? I thought Hime was like a one-time like rock star of just like randomly being assigned to the Demon Lord, you know, quest and he became a hero like that, but apparently bro is like vanquished so many different things too? What? Stuff. He also was just a standout person, volunteering at the fucking local homeless shelter. Oh, demons. Oh, demons. Oh, demons. That's crazy. Because, like, this is lining up with season one, episode, like, one, when he died, huh? And, like, this is when like, the demons start to attack like Weirbel's village. Right? That's when Himal died, right? So we're... Wait, what? What? Yeah, 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 yeah. And, and, and then Freedom like, goes off and time passes more. Uh, whoa, that's weird. Whoa, the timelines, it's all... Whoa. He was just a kid in the beginning of the season and then we heard a time skip and... Okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> Himmel making his mark. Weirbel like gives her like his own entire life story. <laughs> he tries to like relate to her by using Himmel. <laughs> Frieden's just still reading the grammar. It's like, uh... What, 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 are you what are you trying to say? Get to the point. Sorry, this is a Wendy's. What, what are, you, are, you, are you trauma dumping? Did I ask for your life story? <laughs> Come on, Frieden! <laughs> okay. okay. Did she even listen? Did she even listen? Alright, bye bye. True, and I think she has been trying to. Death isn't the only goodbye in this life. Wow. What a line dropped by Weirbell, huh? All these different relationships, all these different moments, that may be just insignificant little specks in her lifetime. Could mean a lot to other people, you know? Death isn't the only goodbye in this life. I hope she knows by now. Did she even listen? Oh, backstory. Are we literally like helping an old man cross the road right now? Like, when we have like high just like, like, sorry. Fucking I Ison's like, yo, we, we gotta kill the Demon King. It's like, no, we gotta do these little side quests first. Uh, we gotta help old man cross the road. <laughs> but? What a hero! What a hero! One last female moment? One last female moment? Why is he mocking us this last female moment? Look at that, look, look, look at that, look at that distinction right here, bro. Look at those lines. Goddamn. Bro mogged us on the last episode. Nice. Happy memories. Bring guests? Is this some kind of party? Wait, what is it? <laughs> Another memeable freedom picture? 
Zeri bans Frieden from the party? Miss Frieden is prohibited per Miss Zeri. <laughs> Thousand years? Thousand year ban? Nothing. One thousand year of bed. She's so petty. Zeta is so petty. She's like a child. Alright, bye, Frieden. Okay. Start gonna leave her? Okay. Well, so much for the guests, huh? What is this? Is this like an event? Some kind of outing? Oh, it's like receiving the privileges. Oh, it's like a coronation event. Like, you know, you become. Here's a medal. Oh. That's from Flame, right? I think. In this era, Fern will probably become a more famous mage than me. That is some foreshadowing, huh? This is some like end game stuff, huh? This is like when, I don't know. This is like truly like the end of Freedom when it's like I don't know. Fern might be at the prime or like at the end of her life, and she like becomes like a surpassed Freedom or something. What could Freedom? Sorry, Fern do to surpass Freedom who killed the Demon Lord? What could she possibly do to become more famous than that? There's no Demon Lord too. Frida. Kill Frieden. <laughs> Kill Frieden, dude. <laughs> oh, learn guy. Learns to guy, right? He's the other human acknowledged by Zede. It's Flamme. Learn. Denken. That's been acknowledged. The humans. Mm -hmm. I thought he couldn't. I thought the whole point was like he couldn't see the fluctuations. That's why Fern couldn't. That's why Fern was even more hyped up last episode. But hold up. He can? Right. It's not... Right. The fluctuations were for Frieden. Not Zeri. Sorry, sorry. It was... The fluctuations that he couldn't see was Zeri's. Right? He could see Frieden's. And that's why he even said it in the beginning of this training arc. And that the, the whole... Uh, w w the entrance exam, like, everybody was there. He, like, saw freedom, right? There was an exact scene there. Yeah, you're right, you're right. right. He would have been him if he was uh, born a generation behind. What do you want, bro? Wait, 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 the only one of Zeri's students whose name is remembered is her first Flamme. That's right, Flamme, then it's learning, then maybe Denkin's acknowledged, right? Flamme, that's right. Alright, where are you going with this? You want other people to know about Flamme. Is bro like... Having... Last minute regrets about Cloud and he's like, nah, I want to like cement my legend, my legacy. He's trying to pull up right now. Really? Okay. Okay. Oh shit. I didn't expect to fight this episode. The barrier is getting trashed though. Look at that cut. Is she even trying though? Actually, Stark is like, what the fuck? <laughs> Waste of time. For who? Maybe for both. Okay. I won't erase you from history? <laughs> or what? Uh. Yeah, also, this is very hypocritic last episode, huh? I was saying it was like, hmm, you like flower magic? Pussy. Weak. Trash. And then immediately, she's just like looking at pretty flowers the entire time. I, I, I don't know what that was about. Yeah, you did. You were such a hypocrite last episode. Like, okay. Because the philosophy was different. But no one could surpass Flame? Hmm? See, you cared. Oh, learn. This is the golem, right? This is the golem, right? I think this is confirmation that he did make the golem, right? Because I'll remember that. She's just like straight up the most Sundere tiger Asian mom, right? She can never tell her children that I love you. She'll only say you're a fucking failure. You're fucking nothing. You're never gonna be nothing. And then 
When all the children leave her, she's gonna be like, I, I always love them. I always love them. Uh, no duel, huh? No duel? She got injured for fucking no reason. Wow, congrats. That old man just hit us. Fern, go get him. Yeah, you are Walker. You're just like, standing there. You're so awkward right now. Both you and I. You and I is obviously learning, but you. Is it Zere that he's saying instead of Frieden here? Who is he? Because, like, this could be interpreted as you could be Frieden, but because he just saw Zere before, I think it's Zere, right? Right? This, this, this scene of Zere with the cape on. I think it's like, yeah, we're both awkward. We just, we're just battle freaks. Stark is like super popular with the kids. What a Giga Chat, dude. <laughs> Sensei! I'll take everything you learned and apply it to defeat the demons. Sensei came back! He actually had a different NPC line this time. He didn't say the same stuff. Well, it's because it's a different location, right? The NPCs have different dialogues depending on which location of the map they're in, right? So when they're on top of the cliff, he can only say, I've taught you everything I've known. Sarabada. <laughs> but then when, you know, the, when he's in here and then, and then the, the, the person's about to leave, then the NPC of the dialogue is, <laughs> good luck. Let's see this again. It's so good. The bald guy is the best, dude. Does he even have a name? Who is he? I, was he some hero in the past? Ah. The best arc. I love this arc, bro. Yeah, you're popular, bro. Oh, yeah. You can ask for any spell, right? Any spell. Would it be something funny and goofy? Like, I, I got a new spell to get all the desserts I've ever wanted in the world. Maybe something for Frieden. A special spell for Frieden? At the end of the day, we're traveling up north to basically reach this place where we can recast Flamie's magic to talk to Himmel in the afterlife, right? Is it related to that? Or is it going to be something goofy? Like, oh, I just fucking have a new magic to just make cookies and shit now. No? Permanent flower perfume smell on clothes? Just like master, just like apprentice. Frieden taught her well. Yep. Useless. <laughs> Practical skills. You know what? For laundry, like, like, think about it. Like, actually, though, like, if you're traveling all the time and you don't have, like, clean access to sources, honestly, this magic will be super convenient, super practical. You're always gonna be stinky and the clothes are gonna get dirty, right? You don't have, like, a place to wash your shit if you're just walking all over the place. But with this, it actually kind of makes sense. Well, like, think about this, right? Imagine, like, I asked for, like, the ability to have air conditioning, right? And you would think, what the fuck? Air conditioning magic? That's fucking stupid. But then you realize, no, it's actually really fucking busted. It's really efficient. It's really convenient. <laughs> That's a legendary level spell. <laughs> legendary <laughs> level. <laughs> Good job, Farron. Truly, that is her student. Yeah, Zeta was like, what the fuck? Wait, Zeta also has that face, the freedom face, dude. <laughs> Are you insane? Yes. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, oh, Lavine? We haven't said bye to them yet. Good luck. It has been fun. These are a great addition to our party, man, during this arc. Goodbye, Yuri couple. I wonder what Zion is up to. Kraft will just show up for like a random episode and leave. That's what he always does. Backstory. He mailed us quick goodbyes. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like a long, cheesy, mopey goodbyes or... I don't know. I feel like a quick goodbye. We're chill. It's, this isn't a goodbye. It's see you later. I, I don't know. I, I think it's all right. There's the ending. Tearful goodbyes aren't our style. That's right. It's not goodbye. It's see you later. Good line. Good line, Himel. Looks like that's the end of Frieden, huh? 
Did Zines find the MILF? Zines! He found the MILF. Oh my god, he actually did it. Oh my god, he did it. Oh wait, we got a little bit of, a little bit of post credit? What, what is this? This walk-in? He just sling the lines from Himel. Title drop. It would be embarrassing when we met again. And ladies and gentlemen, that's Frieden. The number one ranking anime in my anime list above Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. And honestly, I think it deserves it. Even though this, you know, most of my, you know, audience, because we're just dumb isekai fans, native isekai fantasy shows like Frieden doesn't really do well on my channel, but still been a delight to watch it. I love this show. This has been great. Like, first four episodes was kind of like a slow burn, then it immediately gets super hyped with the dragon stuff, right? Then a demon plot, then the second core was just like all peak, bro. It's just like peak fantasy, just peak entrance level, like entrance exam marks kind of style, right? This has been fantastic, and I cannot wait for season two announcement. But hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content, and until next time, take care.